The settings discussed in this training affect your individual user account only. Some of the settings are global and will be seen in all of your projects. Others are project or session specific. When working on the analysis or review pages, the document viewer can be popped out into a second screen and moved to a second monitor. First, let's navigate to the review page by using the Pages menu at the upper left-hand corner of the screen. Use the Views drop-down to select the two-screen arrangement located at the bottom of the drop-down list. Return to the one-screen arrangement by using the Views drop-down and selecting the one-screen arrangement setting at the top of the drop-down list. This setting sticks for your current project in your current user session. If you navigate to another page or another project, the two-screen arrangement automatically resets back to one screen. Two-screen arrangement is also available on the Analysis page. The Preferences page contains three settings you may wish to adjust. These settings are specific to your user account. If you modify a setting, it applies globally across all your matters on the same pod. To access the page, click the Person icon in the upper right-hand corner of the screen and select Preferences from the menu. The Number of Results per Page setting allows you to change the number of documents that appear in your results list. The default is 30 documents per page. If you prefer a larger number, select 50 or 100. When data is ingested into Accelerate, a time zone is selected, and that is the time zone you see when viewing documents. If you prefer, you can convert the document dates and times to your local time zone. Just select your time zone from the drop-down. It is important to note that any changes made to the time zone will only affect the way that times are displayed in your date smart filters, as well as date metadata that is shown in the user interface, like the document results list. These changes will not have any effect on the underlying metadata of the original document time zone as it was ingested. The same holds true for time format settings. The default time format is a two-digit day, two-digit month, and four-digit year, followed by hours, minutes, and seconds. Alternative formats exist for selection, and you can pick any format you prefer. Next is Document View Configuration. This option sets your preferred document viewing method for all views except Text View, which always uses Page Mode. Scroll allows you to scroll through an entire multi-page document using the Viewer scroll bar. You will still see the page numbering at the bottom of the screen and in Thumbnail View, but the pages auto-advance when you scroll. Page limits scrolling to one page of a document. However, this option comes with better performance, especially when viewing complex documents. To move between pages, use the Page Navigator at the bottom of the viewer or expand Thumbnail View and use it to move between pages. Next is Bulk Tagging Options. Clear document selections in the results list after bulk tagging by default, after you bulk tag documents, the document remains selected in the results list. If you prefer to have the document selections cleared after a bulk tag action, select this checkbox. Show bulk tagging confirmation message. When you bulk tag documents and click Save, a confirmation message reminds you that you may overwrite existing field values. This setting lets you decide when you want the confirmation message to display based on the number of documents you have selected for bulk tagging. Your options are to display the message when more than one document is selected. By default, the message displays when you select and bulk tag more than one document. To have the message display less often, leave this checkbox selected and increase the number in the when number of documents selected in the results list is more than area. To never see the message, 
clear the show bulk tagging confirmation message checkbox entirely. Click the apply button at the bottom right of the screen once your preferences are set. To return to the analysis page, select analysis from the pages menu. The results list can also be customized for your individual preference. On the toolbar button for the results list, you will see three customization options. Comfortable versus dense changes the amount of white space displayed between documents. Switch the toggle to see the difference. This setting sticks across projects. Group sort menu. A simple way to sort the results list is to click the name of a column's header row, such as document title. Not all columns are sortable. If you hover on the column name and your mouse pointer turns into a hand, it's sortable. Group sort on the toolbar menu contains a group by family option. This box is checked by default, which organizes the results list so child family members are displayed directly under parent family members. Notice the document title column provides a visual display of the family relationship. If you do not care for families to be sorted together, uncheck this box. This menu also allows you to layer up to three sort options. For example, you can sort by custodian, then document date, and then file extension. Note that the custom sort sticks to the current project only, as field options may differ between projects. You can also customize which fields display as columns in the results list. Click the column drop-down. The entire field list is displayed, including coding fields. Fields currently contained in the results list are checked. Add additional fields by selecting them or remove fields by deselecting them. Click and hold a field name and move it up or down to change the position of the field. Click Apply, and the results list updates to display the changes. The column order can also be changed directly from the results list. Click and hold a name in the column header and move the column right or left, releasing the column when it's in your preferred location. Column settings sticks to the current project only as field options may differ between projects.